Well, as it hits the one year mark in its new location, the popular Avenue 26 night market is finding its footing and providing a safe space in an uncertain time for many food vendors. After LA City shut down its original location in Lincoln Heights, well, the night market is open and thriving on Sports Arena Drive in Pico Rivera. KCAL 9's Rick Montanez is there live right now, Rick. And I know you have all the food for us. It smells so good where you're at. <laughs> Of course, yeah, if you can only smell it, but you can certainly see behind us, it is a crowded night here at the Avenue 26 night market. So many people eating and enjoying the music and atmosphere, but it is the vendors, as Leslie mentioned, who say this is a safe space, including one man who is still recovering after one year ago. Whether it's mixing up mariscos, grilling asada, or preparing potatoes for the fryer, these vendors are hard at work, including Ignacio Torres. He says he's scared to sell on the streets now. Last August, he was stabbed in an unprovoked attack in Boyle Heights. He says work is tough sometimes because he's still recovering. Me siento más confiado porque, eh, hay más protección. But now he's happy to be working again at Avenue 26 Night Market. It's held each Saturday at the Pico Rivera Sports Arena, a new home after the city of LA shut it down from the original location in Lincoln Heights. There were complaints of trash, a lack of security, and out of control parking, but now, that's all covered at this new location. We really did want to prove a point that we could come together, organize it, and do it well. And thankfully, after a year, it's, it's looking like we, we got there. Now the next step is to keep it going. Saul Peralta and his family are vendors who helped organize the night market. They've created a safe space for about 70 vendors to work and entertain. Thankfully, there's places like this where they could come and feel safe to just vent till midnight with no worries that nothing's going to happen. We're bringing the tally and it's it's awesome when people come over here just for us. So it's good. It's a good feeling. And the crowds love everything about it. There's a lot of culture and community here and yeah. also very um, legit Mexican food. Yeah. Some yeah. real good food. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So there's a lot for people to really enjoy here. It is free to get in. It runs from 5 to midnight on Saturdays here at the Pico Rivera Sports Arena. The event organizers are hoping to keep it free, so they're having a fundraiser in two weeks, a comedy night, a special night, they say. And the goal, of course, is to have a safe space for people to eat and have fun and gather. Reporting live in Pico Rivera, Rick Montanez, KCAL 9 News.